My name is Pat Soares and I'm chairman of Carnoustie Golf Links. I was born and brought up in Carnoustie, so golf has always been part of my life. I come from a golfing family, so I was literally given a golf club at the age of about two, just about the same time as I could walk, I got a golf club put in my hand. I became chairman of Carnoustie Golf Links in 2014, but Carnoustie Golf Links has always been part of my family. My uncle was the first chairman of Carnoustie Golf Links, Dougal Thompson, and my father, Ron Bell, who was a farmer, he was Green's convener of Carnoustie Golf Links throughout the 80s and early 90s. He worked very closely with our previous Links superintendent, John Philp, to bring the golf courses back to championship condition. In 1975, after the Open, which Tom Watson won, we lost, we, we were taken off the Open Championship rota. The courses became into quite a bit of disrepair and they worked very hard to bring it back to championship condition. So I've always been involved with Carnoustie Golf Links in some way or another. I think the three things that stick out to me are one, when we got charitable status. That gave us the opportunity to give back to the town of Carnoustie to help organisations and to help the town that I love so much. The second thing, obviously, we're standing here in Lynx House. This gave us the opportunity to give golfers the five-star experience that they have on our golf course. We know we've got the most challenging and best golf course, but what we wanted to do was make sure that whole experience was there and Lynx House and the Rookery Restaurant allow us to do that. And then of course, the pinnacle, the icing on the cake for my chairmanship, the return of the Open Championship. So it's all hugely exciting for Carnoustie and I can't wait to see the champion golfer of the year coming through the last four holes, the crucible that is Carnoustie.